life of the Loteria card. I have a very special treat for you all. I'm going to show you how to make your very own DIY Loteria costume. I've been getting a lot of requests from you how I made my Sirena costume, which I'm going to drop in the link below. It was super easy and cheap to make. The materials you'll need for your Loteria card will be two boards of a sturdy 36 by 40 board. You'll need two paint mixer sticks. You'll need paint, and I recommend getting primary colors, paint brushes, painter's tape to mask off your lines, Gorilla Glue, and a box cutter. And don't forget your pencil. Now that we have all of our materials, we're gonna start putting the board together. We're gonna start off with making the circle in the board, and that's gonna be the circle that you're gonna push your body through. I'm using a plant holder for my circle because I am not the best at drawing perfect circles. Now we're gonna grab our box cutter and we're gonna start cutting our outline that we made. Now that we have our circle cut out, we're gonna start crazy, not crazy glue, Gorilla Gluing our boards together. So we're gonna grab our Gorilla Glue and we're gonna put Gorilla Glue on the edge of our board right here. We're going to grab our painter stick and we're gonna put Gorilla Glue on it. So this is going to reinforce the two boards together. Here's a good trick to holding down your stick because it's gonna wanna move around i grabbed the circle that we had the cut out and i grabbed my harry potter books i'm just gonna lay them on top like that and it's gonna put a lot of weight on them we're gonna repeat the same step on the other side so we're gonna have two painter sticks on each side of our circle now that we have our glue dried on our board and it's hella sturdy so this gorilla glue worked really well we're going to start masking off the borders of our Loteria card. So we're going to mark one inch around our whole Loteria card. And then we're going to mark 1.7 for our black border around the card. After we have marked off one inch around our whole Loteria card, I'm going to start putting tape all around the border and this is going to mask off where I'm going to start painting. This is the part where it's going to be different for a lot of you guys. So because I'm doing the chalupa, I am going to start sketching out the bow and the trees in the back. This is something that my abuelita would love to see because I grew up playing Loteria with my abuelita and she would say La Sirena or La Chalupa so I am now a life-size version of La Chalupa card. I got to adjust my reposo. I find it's funny that I have to wear a black wig now that I have uh, purple hair. It's kind of funny. I loved how this card turned out. The flowers, the, the fruit in my basket, the water, everything came out so beautifully. The only thing is the trees are a little bit crooked, but that's okay. You don't have to be perfect as long as it comes out the way you want it to come out. Thank you to Fabi and Jose for helping me put this card together. It was a lot of fun. I hope this inspires you to make your very own Loteria card. I would love to see what you guys come up with. I wanna give a shout out to Angela M. She is the subscriber of the week. She's always commenting on our videos, which we love seeing her comments. Thank you so much. Please like and share this video. If you see me out there, please don't throw frijoles at me. Did I win Loteria? Did I win? Until next time. Bye. Hey. Damn. <laughs> the life of the Loteria card.